Story Show. I'm your host, Nancy Akon. Today we've got great, very beautiful ladies all the way from Kisumu. They start by introducing themselves. My name is Lea Tandura. I am from Kisumu. I'm 20 years old. I'm a photographer, Akiba Emile. I came to Nairobi for a, a photo exhibition. Now, I'm feel like you come live. I'm very happy about it because today I'm still there for the talk show. Now, is it your first time for Fujanai? No, no, it is this the third time I'm coming to Nairobi. So you stay in Kisumu? Yeah. Okay, I'm um, Ekla Wino, 22 years old from Kisumu. I am a photographer. I came all the way to Nairobi for the photo exhibition. And uh, today I'm, have, I'm here for a talk show with my fellow girls. Okay, my name is Catherine Aching. I'm 19 years old from Kisumu, executive director of Dala Voice, and I'm a media advocate and a writer. And I also came for the same event, the photo exhibition. Yeah. So, this photo exhibition, we are going to be a part of the photo exhibition, we are going to be a photo exhibition. What is it all about? Kate, can you tell us? So, uh, the photo exhibition is under PEPFA. PEPFA was celebrating their 15 years of existence in Kenya. So, we were actually the guys who were brought on board to do the production, do the documentation of the 15 girls and to tell their stories through photos. So in the production, of the, I was the production coordinator and we had the photographers and the videographers. So that's why we came to see our work, what impact you have created through the photos and the videos. Wow. So meaning that this book was produced by you? Yes, that is see our perfect. work. Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is it on market? Am I going to up a display? Oh, so it depends. It depends. It depends what? Uh, can you depend now? To see me come out to our exhibition, we we'll part for free. But we, we don't know. We, are, we, have, we have not yet discussed or decided if it if it are called for sale or for, for free. So we mean it's a part for free? You mean that you are going to be So we are going to find a new call for the exhibition. Okay. Are you a photographer? A filmmaker? You see this event too? I was a photographer. Okay. Are you happy? I was a photographer too. Wow. I may achieve the age of 19. That's great. So, Rolls Gani work on a play Jana kwa photo exhibition. I was a photographer too. I was a, the production coordinator. Wow. Yeah. Mm. Kona vision. <laughs> <laughs> Naiso skills. Mnye milito wa wapi. Mililala tu mka mka subwe mka jipata mini photographer. Mkali niza shoot video kali. Eh? Nika inda tu pepfa. Nika ingia na nika shoot yo video kali. Nye milito wapi zo skills. Kit. So, easy skills. Atupu zaliwa nazo. Skills, there was a project under dreams. So uh, we got picked from one of the, some of the girls that were in the, that project. So after being picked, we were engaged in another project called Reza Shadada Project. This is where we are taught media, ICT, and life skills. So through media, we learn kukwao photographers, we learn kukwao videographers, we learn kukwao writers. Yeah. Okay, I am a and a community media trust organization. Project. So in this project, we were taken around 48 girls in Kisumu and uh, to be quite empowered to have uh, media skills, ICT, and life skills. So that's where I got the skills of photography and uh, media production. Can you tell us these skills we taught? Okay, in the same time, I have a message. I'm a, student, I'm a student from Community Media Trust and I was a Shadada project. So, what is this of the Shadada project? Who are these dream girls? In your FE2, I mean, I float to Nikola Pajuata, dream, I start to dream girl, dream girl. Eh, I'm missing a dream to my means, Jana. Okay, this is a project that empower girl child for self independent, independent. 
So will I empower in what way? Giving them skills like media, IT. Yeah. Okay, dream girls, name for the same who empowered the girl child uh, is equally madame was equally vulnerable in the society because you realize that most madame was vulnerable in the society that's why they brought up the idea of dream girls to empower and to mentor the girl child you know, so like Sisi Watatu we've gone we've been mentored we've been empowered that's why not to skills that's why Una has some like to me put a girl pen fat or my name, but she's still young. It's because of the empowerment and the mentorship program that you've been going. So what would be feeling the ADK is cook a dream girl? Go feel like they I'm talking about yeah, we had dream girl. Unaka like ah I'm a unakatus. So being a dream girl is having something to present before people. It's being empowered, it's being me- mentored. Kukua a dream girl in a kupayo platform yenye. You have something to present in, in terms of skills, in terms of ideas. You can share something with people. Si tu kama kukuam to reja reja. If you tell someone that you are a dream girl, in their mind they expect you to have a skill, something to present that is different from someone, maybe a girl out there who did not have the opportunity to, of being a dream girl. Yeah. No. No. Okay, me feel nice because uh, if you are a dream girl, uh, you have the potential to stand out. No, no. At least, stuff when you meet I'm able to stand out, I'm able to speak out, I'm able to express myself before, before people through the skills they give me. That's all. Uh, okay, me, I feel good at being a dream girl. Because it has given me skills, and now maybe I can say I can de- depend on someone, somebody's money because I have skills. I can use my skills to get money and fish. Oh, yeah. Wow, that's a good thing. I'm empowered. 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 I'm yeah, with the shadada, what wanna kube banga ji kumta. Okay, mimi no jungine no jungine na na wana wa meet maybe to to kill kwa event or say hey you know then I'm a song I'm very na watu wa uko uko na mta wale wenye ufanyangi kitu labda wana kube banga ji wana any wana chama ki opportunity wana say hey you go join to me with that since me and the party opportunity and then that I am not like you are wasting your time. What I must suggest every time, every now and again, we are going to school every morning, coming back. Now, I have the Bangladesh, the Shakwam, 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 the Okay, okay. Then uh, surrounding PIA to a boy, then uh, me, I also do mentor some young girls and boys. No, no. So they also they have the ads of knowing what I'm doing. They just want to be a photographer like me. Because once in a way, I'm going to take a lot of pictures of the time. Now you're watching like, hey, if you need I just want to do what you're doing. I'm proud of you. Now you're going to take a lot of pictures of the time. Sasa hapo vile una wamenta mtaa wakiwa kwa group watu wako unaangia kia sasa hiki kinaniambia nini nimegrow na yeye huyo anaweza niambia nini nichukie hakuna wale ma ignorant wanaenda ah mimi sije sikiza wewe ndio unaona vitu kama hizo obviously uh, in a ghetto place obviously kuna nyumba kidogo ndogo but una you train bring their minds na watakwa hiyo mind ya 
hiyo kudogo watu ndogo hiyo una unaelewa sasa wewe una ignore ama una acha okay you try explain to somebody ignoring is never the solution hata kama anakuambia wewe kwenda wewe unatubeba aje obviously kuna kuna point ikifikanga usambie unaweza mimi umse point i don't feel like any way you umse ana bring some ana drive something home unaelewa is as much as you answer atako hyper but then ukimwingilia kidogo kidogo atakwenda ah nyu mimi sio ghetto tunafakoa hivi na hivi na hivi atatulia then una bring some sense kwa akili yake unless maybe ni mlevi that is it and just cut off na we get so uh mtaani utabebwa venye umejibeba it depends i may have skills but when you naji present to my community will give them a different perspective of me ita itafanya ni promote your project ama ni lower your project but as for me acha nianze na from my family the view have, have changed a lot people understand you more people rely on you ni, they feel that you are someone when you acha kama ni advice you can give to them they, they feel that kama acha kuna issue na mambo za computer you are there to help them but uh, for community it also depends there are people who will be happy with their progress and some people will not be happy with their progress so for my friends my family my extended family they are happy and they are very grateful for, for me being part of the project wow that's yeah. great so sasa unajua kwa community pia kuna wale wanakutubeba kuna wale wako na wivu wewe una so wivu ni kitu inakuja natural siwezi ku switch on ukwe na wivu ama ku switch off but kama mtu ako interested kujua what i do i'm willing to tell them what i do but kama mtu pia they are very negative about you mjua sasa zingine unaenda kusaidia mtu mwenye ako against you hadi wewe ndio uenda kumeumia but if someone is willing and someone has accepted your situation una try to help penye unaweza and from that point mhm unakuangana chali Eh hey, yako anakubeba ngaje ever since started the program <laughs> project hadi sasa hii mali uko eh anakubeba ngaje so um ni same too there is that pride kesha naweza enda US kesha naweza fanya hii na hii i think there is that pride of kukuwa na mtu mwenye anaweza reason nayo ama akuda utingi unaniambia mimi naenda Nairobi Mimi sio pia ziko but hawezi hawezi stopisha. Sasa wewe unadoingiaje kukwambia eh get sko ni mzuri ile pata mzungu kwa yes. <laughs> but umejua kama una poa kwa relationship inafai kwe someone you can reason with mtu anaelewa. Nikisema mimi life yangu ni field nitarudi saa saba, nitaenda maybe Europe for 30 days anafaa akwe ana reason na wewe. But kama hizi reason na wewe pia unajikata na mbona ulimpenda mbona ukamchagua ye Jupia ni kama tuko na priority same. Ndio anaona life level yangu. Anaona tuki tuki make one step tutaweza kuwa different. Tunaweza change life ya ghetto to move to another level. But kama uko na mtu mwenye pia hapo tu pia hivyo tu ndio utakuwa. <laughs> And you see God fearing. Hey. <laughs> God fearing. Yes. How why? Anaenda nga church kwenda church mimi pia nenda tu church kumbe nenda tu kuangalia vijana wengine huko pia mwezo unaweza enda church but kwa speeches zako kuna vitu kama thank god thank god umepata hiyo opportunity thank god unaenda Nairobi so from that personally na feel hiyo ni kufia god so in every conversation ninyi mna make na chat yako anakwambia ka in Matthew 3 hapana <laughs> <laughs> si hivyo hiyo pia ni uoni sana hapana <laughs> utaki muoni sana hizi <laughs> sema pati ya uoni so if it tell us do you have a boyfriend of course i do mhm ulimpendea nini okay nilimpenda kwa Uh, he's this one guy when he tries to reason for moza same one to talk about things this way and not in funny maybe she don't have future head na so do do you know na future acha tu nikae na yeye ah no no okay ni game and the saidia i can be like this the you should be doing this instead of this ama aku guide in some way una una si uli tele bana bila kwambia ishwe na jua nini acha tu your dream that you see you see it and you go 
God-fearing man. Mm-hmm. Are you sexually active? No. Why? Uh, maybe I yeah, was sexually active. Sees him on the layer. Cause, eh, sees him on the layer. Cause we join jazam to sing. Maybe me ni kona pa Nairobi, mutoa kona jazaki. But for me, uh, niliamwa ku abstain for some time until I'm ready to be sexually active. Then it afungwa your chapter. When you sexually active, na kujanga tu yama mina that the practice make perfect. Unajua kukuwa sexually active I feel ni another page of life tena unafungua ni kitu lazima ukue ready for consequences ni to zita happen and una get so acha mimi kwa perspective yangu siko ready ku open your chapter bado na struggle hapa kungangana kukuwa stable dream girl nataki kufungua another team uko na boy unamwamini uko na future umeona future why not being sexually active Uh, why are we not being sexually active? We are not being sexually active because I'm not ready to be sexually active. Lakini mnafanyanga. Sasa Tutakula. Tutafanya jina tuko sexually active. Hai, kwa nini mnaenda kutuna angalia na hivi kama picha? Naenda shule hapo na kuangalia hivi hadi asubuhi ifike. Nana nimesema si si njia za lakini mna men anafanyanga atifanyangi so if you live get up na do kind of ganya so are you sexually like yeah i don't and what which method of intention Oh, <laughs> 
don't or you need to make a bargain so at the beginning you like like every day every night or every month you yeah, really yeah. then to the now once a year it's good control yourself so una una familia sio ya <laughs> Hebu niambie. Mimi ninatumia gadini. Tumia nga kondo na ikipasuka. Ikipasuka. So, iki ukimak good use of it, aita pasuka. So good use of it ni round 2 ama round 3. Si si mambo na mara hodi. Ni kama tu kama ndio kuweka, unaangalia expiry date, wanyo unaweka kila kitu sasa ukiweka vizuri haitapasuka for how long have you been dating uh, for me in marriage for one year and all along mna tumia tu cd si ndio akikata akata hizi kata ni ule tu twende tutumie sawa kitu a a si mbona we have a goal to achieve so long as i'm in relationship but maybe as far as i'm not ready for the for the risks si ndio I don't want a kid as banana because I'm not stable. Na kondo bi kupasuka na ingi tutatoa. Tutatoa mimba. Ni apana si tatoa ndo maana kwambia I can make good use of it. Na si Mungu akilea mtu ana ndana sani yake. Muona utumie. Sani yake itakuja. Hapana ukitumia kondo mzuri sasa itapasuka aje. Itapasuka. Na sasa ni mtu tu utatumia. Kama unamwamini na mimi namwamini na tuko na future. Why use kondo? Why? No need of it. The stuff everything. Ah. Oh. Mashinda. <laughs> so, can you tell us your best moments, dream girl, your worst moments? If tell us. Okay, my best moment uh, is when I was chosen to go to South Africa. Oh. I never knew that chance was meant for me. Really? Yeah. <laughs> pleasure <laughs> i never knew that chance was meant for me and the way we can do it if we actually that's not how it was my parents got to have some dinner then i just got a call if hi hi this is that to be in south africa now we need south africa to find me na kwa nini ni chaguo kwa south africa okay um i went to south africa to do photography when it's my before i have that passion in photography So that's what that is the key thing that took me there. Apart from just adventuring, it was the main thing that took me to South Africa. Then uh, uh, before then, to be to do uh, to look around eight girls. We were taken to do some stock photography in Kenya. And uh, probably I don't know they were in Tsavo, but probably in my mind I happened to win. Oh. That's why I was chosen to go to South Africa to do the same in South Africa. Why? Kwani yao ni mwa girls wengine nini wa luck ama walikuwa wasilini sana. Mwanga pana ndeke. Hapana it doesn't go with body size ama hapana ni kupendelewa. No. It is not just it kupendelewa. Ni mkono wako ni ni kazi ya mkono wako na bidi yako. Ume ume produce nini on the table and uh, yes to that for me na fit me produce the same. Unaona? But then Oh, passion na kwa aje in this thing that we produce how how we go about it we produce and all such kind of things so it's a long process uh, before you get to to choose who is the best among the best right. no tell me your worst moment okay my worst moment i don't know <laughs> we have this one teacher this madam teacher of ours uh to that Uh, of course we have business groups uh, i'm from akiba images and i was here there so we have this one show comes i want your creative briefs to be written so we make proposals of what you want to do projects then he looks at them then i get the feedback so every time we like a proposal here to like no <laughs> every time we do we 
Instagram Nancy Kifa, Twitter Ogola underscore Nancy, and email Ogola Ogola Nancy Andred at gmail dot com. Can you tell us one last one to pay advice your mucho? Advice your mucho. So uh, what I can say, there are two things: one to go appreciation, and another one to go what your mucho. So uh, what I want to say to Weza Shadada ni a good project ni project yenye haikututumia kama project zingine zenye zinaweza kuweka time wageni wako unavaa t-shirt hapana sisi tume, tumelelewa kujitetea tumelelewa kutumia skills zako hata kama the mentors are not there you can do something on your own they are a must for kwe apo and i'm really grateful and if they are doing another project ikwe na your same mindset so for the last word I want to tell the youth out there hakuna mtu atakupea kitu for free na kuna mtu anaku owe anything kwa hii world it's either ujitete ama u lose hakuna mas utaona hata sikukua ma youth itaisha tu someday but lazima ujitete kwa life lazima uji support u prove to someone who wants to help you that I am worth your help siati sisi tunapewa tu wewe ni youth mimi niko Uh, 16 to 24 so ni petu hapana no one holds you anything you have to work for it so na wewe ni net what your um, last remark okay me i want to i just want to advise the youths i uh, want to tell them not to sit upside there there's not nothing comes on a silver platter so you must go and look for some things when you go, get it and even the bible saying knock and you will be given so if you don't knock meaning i'm not there yeah kwambia leo napata mafumbo hapa na bible verses so tutaka hii studio kama tumaokoka and if you can you tell us your last remark okay before i say my last remark i want to say that we have the various akiba images uh we do photography uh for events stock photography and studio fashion so we based in kisumu and and ukengele hizo mabendi zifanyika zote mjini Kisumu yani kazi yetu and we are proud of that so kama unataka kufanya wedding unataka photos of stock family unataka uone mwenye familia yake na grow from one point to another akiba images tuko hapa kindly just be power number our emails social media you will get us we always there to serve you so at um, facebook akiba images Uh, IG Akiba Images, Twitter at Akiba Images, and uh, our email is akibaimages@gmail.com. And uh, my last remark to everyone is, this is my day to pada za bwerere, so me too kwa hiyo. When it's it's high time to go your comfort zone and start thinking of something that you can do, isn't it? It's high time my day wa ngali kenya na zafanya to improve of their lives na iwasaidie in future to come. You know when change things get more harder life gets more difficult so simple as much to adjust as my you the senior so thanks to community media trust was a shadow project i'm glad to be one of the one of them uh, and being given the opportunity is is more than what i thought i could be it has given me more than a, more than what i thought i could be niko hapa na najua naenda mbali so mimi nimesema mmesikia tu kutoka kwa si wati mara ho nipate message kwa twitter mara ho ni see you more and more conversation follow us on twitter facebook and instagram as it appear on the screen at dada underscore talk show see you next time for the next episode